Hey, I'm Florian Kohler, also known as Venom, and today I wanted to introduce your brand new tutorial series sponsored by MassQ. We're going to cover some pretty difficult shots, and uh, it should be quite interesting. Uh, the first one we're going to do is what I call the machine gun mass ace. First off, the mass AQ. Um, it's a slightly different cue than what a normal cue would be. So, first off, the weight. So that's a heavier cue. It's about 25 to 26 ounces. Uh, then it's slightly shorter. It's uh, a little bigger than a jump cue, but shorter than a plain cue. Uh, the main characteristic of a mass AQ is is the shaft, really. So, it's a 14 millimeter tip, unbreakable ferrule, it's phenolic and the shaft is Kevlar and carbon, so it's a very solid cue because you're gonna hit a lot of time and you really don't want it to break, so whatever you can do with a mass AQ, you can pretty much do with a plain cue as well the problem is you're gonna break a plain cue, meanwhile a mass AQ will be really solid and on top of that the weight is gonna help you tremendously to you know, get the power translated okay so we're gonna need all 15 balls for that shot uh, it's actually pretty easy to set up, it looks kinda time consuming but it really isn't that bad so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put up like a bunch of balls here so already, so it's right by the edge of the, the pocket there, so I have five balls. I'm going to start making a line, so the, the good thing, the, the thing you really have to do about this shot is you have to make sure all the balls are frozen, so there's, there can't be any gap, because if there's a gap, you know, it's going to cause problems. And then I just kind of grab them two by two, and then put them, and I keep having them frozen together. So. Once you've done all the one you have, you keep going and you just remove one ball at a time. Keep going. We're going to put the nine ball on the side so everybody can see it. And I'm going to keep making the line here. All right, so for the last part here, the setup, usually you can put three balls. So it gives you some weight. But if you're good at it, you can put two and it actually kind of looks better too. So, Last part of that shot from the setup is you're gonna bring your cue ball and you're gonna put it right here. So you gotta make sure you don't you know, disturb the line here. Make sure they're in line. Uh, you can have a slight gap with the five, but it's, you know, it's kind of better if it's frozen. And then, there you go. Here's your setup for the machine gun mass ace. So the goal of that shot is you're gonna hit the cue ball, uh, mass ace shot. You're gonna make the three here. The cue ball is gonna come back, hit basically every ball, make the nine ball last. So. You gotta hit it with quite some power and uh, you know try to make sure it stays on that line. So what I do in the cue ball is I put low and left, uh, quite a bit of left because you really don't want the ball to go out, so you really can't put any right spin. But it's mainly low left. Okay, so you know, if you take the clock as usual, you're gonna look at the clock here. You're gonna probably aim about seven. So you know normal mass a shot. What I do for a mass is I grip the back of the cue like that. You know, you could do it like that too. I find it nicer now to have it this way, so you just kind of grab it. Uh, normal bridge, close bridge. The key to have a good solid stamp on mass A is you're gonna try to get your elbow kind of like tucked in right here, so it's really stable, so kind of like this, right? So if you have a lot of room here, it's gonna be very difficult for you, but if you kind of tuck it in like that, you should be all good, so. Again, you know, you kind of find your line here, try to stay in a straight line, go, kind of put my elbow, make sure I'm stable, aim for my seven o'clock, and I'm good to go. There you go. And that's how you do the machine gun mass A. So that one was pretty good, a lot of power to it. But remember when you start, you know, if you can put one extra ball, if you don't work, put an F force ball. You know, just try to make sure he goes along the nice line and it's a very good first shot to start Massey. Thanks for watching, that was the Machine Gun Massey. Stay tuned for more Mescue tutorials.